pace truck is off. Green flag is in the air. I think we saw a teammate start there, Phil. I, it sure looked like it, didn't it? Corey Heim with a nice jump. Gets ahead of the pack as they start to file in line. And there's no question that's the Venturini Motorsports plan is, is to get together, try to stay up front, try to get single file, and puts it logs some laps. There's a reason they've been very successful around this place. Corey Heim, of course, the winner here a year ago. That was a heck of a way to kick off the season for him. See what happened with Tony Breidinger here. That's Dale Quarterly, the five car, the old, the old Bobby Gary. Oh, a little bit of a bump there. There was, a, there was a little bit of room. The 57, Brian Doza was up the racetrack a little bit. Oh, we've got a spin. The seven goes around. Caution is out. That's Eric Caudell. And this is what happened under break. What do you see here? Well, I see an incredible save by the 25. And then, honestly, with Will, without Will Kimmel, I think, behind her, she's probably ended up wrecked. You know, Will's the most veteran guy in the field. Uh, without a guy like that behind you, it would have been trouble, I think. We're still under caution. 56 laps to go from Daytona. Caution at Daytona for the third time. Andy Jankowiak involved. Multiple wrecks, multiple cars involved. See the 97 of Jason Kitzmiller. The wreck started on the backstretch with the 97 of Jason Kitzmiller, and then that was a shot we had of the leaders that are on or, were on or, around the racetrack. Well, that's happened. Maybe they were just, <laughs> somebody slowed down when they saw the caution flag and somebody ran. Let's take a look at it. Yeah, this is all the way back in turn number two. This is where this ac initial accident is going to start. You see some, some pretty close racing here. The 97 gets turned. It might have been Nick Sanchez that was behind him. He might have got crowded by the 97 of Jason Kitzmiller. And you see the leaders going out of your screen way down the racetrack. And the caution's already out here, Phil. In the middle you, of that straightaway. You see the caution lights yet. right up there, middle of your screen flashing. See Greg Van Alst on the outside, Daniel Dye. Another view of that Will Kimmel, uh, 68, got a little yeah, piece of that. Maybe not a, a great deal of damage to Will's car. But I'm really curious to see what happened with the leaders as we were all watching this wreck here on the backstretch. Caution so is, flag already out. Yeah, caution flag out already out for 10, 15 yeah. seconds probably. Do you think they just didn't see the caution come out? You see Van all sideways there. It's almost like the 35. Just you know, he knew it was yeah. under caution, was rolling up, and then they they put him three wide. He probably didn't even know he was. Somebody three wide. was pushing the 55, trying to go through the middle of the 35 on the outside, and Greg Van also I don't think realized that they were there in the middle, came down the racetrack a little bit, and they made contact. Here, you can hear it see it right here. Riding on yeah. board with Daniel Dye. He said, there goes my dancing partner. Doing a great job here at Daytona for the first time, and the green flag is out again. I'm interested to see how Venturini does his start, if they were going to try to get you know, Corey and Tony down on the bottom. And it looks like he's trying to drag back Parker Chase's, but Without any help from behind, I don't know if Tony's going to be able to get down. Now she's really going to have to work hard to get down and, and on the bottom. And Sean Core here is going to try to pick her up and help her. But she's got really a lot of really strong cars behind her here. So many show up here at Daytona, and they know I've only got this chance and maybe one other race. So you tried too hard. Whoa. Oh, what a save. Wow. That was Nick Sanchez. Got really, really loose. He might have a tire going down. Yeah, I think he does. It's it's kind of going back and forth here. In a you can, see, oh, you yeah. can see some rubber come off. He was running in the seventh spot. What a great save. That may be a contender for that Reese's sweet move. Shannon Rush right there. Crew chief for Corey Heim. Corey Heim on the outside. Green and white in the air. Final lap. Sean Core trying to shove his way down to the inside. Couldn't quite do it. We had some contact in the front there. There's Daniel Dye moving by Sean Core. There's Tony being pushed by Drew Dollar. She's trying to keep it locked on that yellow line, staying on the bottom, staying in line. Tony Breidinger right now in the fourth oh. spot, and there's contact. Drew Dollar hard into the wall. I think her and Tony got together there. Big hit for Drew Dollar. 
We're going to race this one out, it looks like. Caution is not out yet. It's so far away to the backstretch. Here he comes. It's been his day. He has absolutely dominated. Corey Hahn does it at Daytona. It's absolutely dominated today from the from the very get go. What a perfect day for that 19 year old from Marietta, Georgia. Good to see that window net down. Yeah. That was a that was a rough hit there it down the back straightaway. Absolutely head on. Drew Dollar quiet all day. Huge hit on the final lap. Now, guys, he's got to put himself together. Jump in that Xfinity car coming up right after this. Let's see what happened here on the final lap with the 18 and the 25. He's helping Tony there. Looks like he's he's giving her a really good push. Maybe just got off centered a little bit. Yeah, just got off centered, and then when she checked up, came back up into him, and it and it turned him obviously in the wrong direction. Luckily, how, didn't get hit by anybody yeah, else. How that, that really didn't bad. collect in other cars That's is unbelievable. Absolutely. We've had a lot of heads up driving all day long. Another yes. good save by Tony. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> She could own the sweet moves of the race. All of them. All, I was going to say, all three of them. All three. Uh, yeah, all three uh, possibilities. I, I think it's a USAC background, the open wheel. Yeah. I, I, I think that's where it all came from.